So I think it's time to tell you guys that All the way Daddy. straight in. What? <laughs> yeah. He got a noodle? What noodle? Daddy, noodle from your head. <laughs> noodle from your head? And if, yeah. you, if you squeeze like the tissue like around it, like, yeah. like if you squeeze Daddy. like hard, uh -huh. like I'm feeling the nerves over here, so like this doesn't hurt as bad either. Okay. Oh, thank you. Can you put it on the table for me? Please, please put it on the table. Here you go. Um, and then like dart, like. <laughs> not, not like where Philip's like. <laughs> no. Okay. Oh, okay. 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 You got Bite this, sister. You're gonna do great. Remember what we said earlier. You're contributing to the baby being born. Okay. Oh no. Kinsley, did you did you pull the string out of the balloon? Oh no. Mm. Hey. Yeah, like the harder you grab, the less it's painful for me. You're gonna be fine. Yeah, piece of cake. Piece of cake. Piece of cake. Am I gonna be fine? Is the question. Is Jessica gonna pass out? Is the question. Okay. What are your last words before you kill your sister in law? Happy baby. Happy mom. Dart hard. <laughs> <laughs> don't dart your finger though. Oh, yeah, don't dart your finger. <clears throat> Ready? I'm supposed to <laughs> sing. I'm, I'm, I'm so sorry. Okay, I'm supposed to sing a song. I forgot. What song are we yeah. doing? What should I sing? Oh, we're halfway there. Oh, what's, the, what's the Bon Jovi one? That's it. Oh, That's no. it. No, the other Bon Jovi. Sorry, the other one. Three, two, one. Oh! Fast or slow? No, that was good. No, squeeze it fast or slow. It's oil, so it's hard to push. Oh. So it's under. Kinsley, did Auntie do so good? Look at you. And you got all of it in. That thing, if actually, if you that squeeze all of it all the way in. That, yeah. yeah, if that needle was like a hundred feet longer, yeah. you still would have made it in in it one push. Went all the way through. Um, how was the it? The shark's okay. container's over there, so you can just okay. throw it in okay. the red. You want to hand me the top, though? Oh no, just throw it in the red. Oh, it's fine. You did it. Are you okay. Yeah. Okay. Mom, High five. <laughs> yeah, that hurt, but it's probably been one of the better ones that I've gotten. Basically, what she's saying is, I did a horrible yeah. job, but. In a couple days, it's gonna be even better. No, you do great. It was just, <clears throat> that one was nice and fast. You did it really fast. And the faster you go, the less painful it is. If you try to push it slowly through the skin, it doesn't feel yeah. Today is medication day again. And part of it is I really want to remember all the whole journey of this IVF process. And so, we got my sister-in-law, Philip's sister, to give me the injection tonight, and she did really good. Um, but I want to remember each and every one of those moments. So that's, you know, the big reason why we're here on YouTube. The big reason why we vlog is, you know, these memories that we have and sharing with you guys. When I was done, um, Jessica, Philip's sister, my sister, um, was asking me how I was feeling about everything about IVF, and I told her, you know, I'm still just like not thinking about it. I'm just going through the motions, doing the medication you know step by step not thinking about it um, just because I feel like that gives me the least amount of stress I'm really thankful that we were able to go um, with my friends um, on a little like getaway this weekend again keeping my mind off of it not focusing on what a big deal this could be I think I'm in a little bit of denial that this could actually happen and I don't mean to be a Debbie Downer I'm not like negative about it feeling like oh like it's never gonna happen for me like it's not that it's just it's never happened we've never had two pink lines and I have heard stories of IVF not working and so I think I also want to be slightly realistic that maybe maybe this won't happen maybe this won't happen this time but it could also which I think is weird. It's weird to think about. I was on social media all the time watching people do their pregnancy announcements, doing their bump dates, all the different things like that, and it, and it was hard for me to the point that I even took a break from social media at 
a couple different points because it was so hard wanting to be a mom so bad and I couldn't. And so we're going into this and I'm just imagining what if I do become pregnant? Like what if I do actually get to carry a life inside of me? Like A, mind blowing, but B, how are we going to kind of go through that journey and enjoy the process while also caring for you know, other people either in our lives or that, that see our story that are still in the hard place, that are still um, having a difficult time. At the same time, I am going to really soak up every minute, every moment of our pregnancy. We are not ones that will wait the full 12 weeks before we tell people that we're pregnant. We'll tell people right away and you guys will probably find out within the day or a couple of days of us finding out that we are pregnant if that happens. And I want to soak up every moment, like every week I've been thinking about bump date videos or photos or like peripheral photos, all those things that every woman has been able to enjoy and been able to do that I never thought that I would do. But I also want you to know of how sensitive I am, of how difficult I know when you're not in that place and you want to be and you have to watch that. So I think it's time to tell you guys that we are doing something kind of fun and kind of neat. We are starting a second channel. We are starting Phil and Alex 2, T-O-O. -O. So it's going to be not our vlog, it's not gonna be our daily life of what we are up to, it's kind of updates or sit downs or things that we talk to you guys about and I'm so excited for that channel you guys I have been wanting to do that for a while there are just certain things and certain topics that we really want to like dig into and talk about and sit down and like really dive into and we just felt like it just having it incorporated in the vlog wasn't what we wanted we wanted to be able to like look back on like specific videos and look at like specific content for example bump dates like I'm excited that you guys can still be here on this vlog and on this channel and on this journey with us. And yes, like if I do become pregnant, like I will become pregnant. And if that's too hard for you to watch, I understand. I completely understand. I was there. It was so hard and I understand. But if you can still be on our journey, we would love for you to be, but maybe you don't want to see every single bump date and, and all the details of pregnancy. So that will actually be on Phil and Alex too. And I shouldn't just talk about pregnancy and bump dates because Philip is gonna be on the channel too and he's gonna be able to do motivational sit downs and, and other projects and topics that we've been wanting to talk about and so we're really excited because we get to just do anything we want over there. So go ahead and check out in the description below and go check out our other channel and go subscribe guys and if you guys aren't already subscribed to this channel, well, welcome, and go ahead and click that subscribe button. It just helps you join our family, join this community, and be able to be on this journey with us. So if you guys go ahead and check out that channel on Phil and Alex 2, and we already um, put up a handful of videos, just um, things that we have been excited to share with you. And in the little intro video, if you wanna leave any suggestions on videos you would also like for us to do, you can leave those there. But guys, that's exciting. We've been holding that in for a while that we are starting Phil and Alex too. And you guys have kind of seen a little bit of behind the scenes when we've been filming a couple of videos, but I love you guys. You guys are wonderful. I'm so thankful for you. I'm so thankful for this community. You guys are awesome and still a lot of fun things to come. So I hope you guys had a wonderful day and you enjoyed my injection from my sister and how well she did give her a little bit of love in the comments too of how great she did and how wonderful she did it just shows you that you don't have to be in the medical field for you to do the IVF injections and things like that but anyways again I hope you guys had a wonderful day and we will see you guys in our next video go let your love multiply bye guys